name is Pat McGuffin. I served 30 years in the Air Force as a weather forecaster and then transitioned to ODVA to be an, uh, initially a veteran service officer and then uh, incarcerated veteran coordinator for the, for the ODVA. Uh, I was motivated to serve uh, for a number of reasons. One thing, I was a young father and a, and, uh, a husband. I wanted to be able to provide for my family. The military provided an option to do that. I wanted to do something to serve my country and also I wanted education benefits, those kinds of things that the military was offering at the time. It seemed like a good fit. I went with the Air Force because it kind of had a reputation for being family friendly, so it seemed like that was the one for me and it worked out okay. Well, my service experience kind of taught me a lot of things. Taught me, you know, be on time, work hard, you know, real good work ethic and to be, you know, devoted to others and to think kind of long term. So in my current job and other things that I do, I, I take all those traits and I do the best I can. And uh, so it helps me to think about down the road, helps me to think about the impact of what I do on other people, not just on me. And so it's been a pretty good experience. The military taught me a lot of things. It's been really good for me. Uh, veteran benefits help other veterans in a lot of different ways. Uh, education, provide education benefits, improve their life, compensation for injuries that they had while they were in service. It's good to know that they get compensated for that in some way. It improves their quality of life, not just for veterans, but for family members. So that's been uh, a big part of what I do, being a veteran service officer. That's, that's what made it rewarding for me, is to connect veterans with benefits that they're eligible for and change their quality of life. Um, I guess, uh, in the end, you know, just to close things up, I, I would encourage people to serve. There's a lot of good that comes from that. Personally, lots of development and growth that can take place, but it's always good to serve others and to serve uh, your country and your fellow man, I think. And I think the, uh, you know, the definition, I like to say military service is a form of service. That's how I look at it. So it's always good to serve and to sacrifice for others. And I think you grow from that experience.